Hey, Sheila Walsh, personal development coach for life, business and relationships. And we're on the ninth unhelpful thinking style. And this one is labeling. So it's when we call ourselves certain names and then we live as if we are them and we start to believe the labels. Like I'm stupid, I'm, I'm dumb, I'm not helpful, I'm ugly, I'm rude, I, I don't know. Whatever labels you have, maybe it's a good time to stop for this video, write them down a bit. What do you tell yourself? What do you call yourself when nobody's listening, when you're talking to yourself? And also, do you use them for other people? Do you use labels to put people into brackets? She's silly, she's dumb, she's stupid, she's ugly, she's pretty, she's smart. You know, when we're using labels, we're not actually being authentic, we're not actually connecting we're kind of limiting ourselves and we're standing in the limitation of the label. So a good way to kind of um, to counteract that is when you have a label, for instance, like I'm stupid, it would be good for you to go out and see how you may also be really smart at some things, really creative. Go and find corresponding labels to kind of counteract that belief. Ultimately, it's okay to be whatever you are, but if you're over identifying with a label, it will tend to keep you stuck for any label because it will mean that whenever you have to make changes or, or journey inwards or do any authentic work, you're gonna keep getting kind of stuck at whatever label it is that you identify with the most. Also, there's no need for a label. You're a full person. You can be a bit of everything and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. So it's a case of you being comfortable with that and seeing other people as full people too, not just one or two labels that you assign to them. That will make it much easier to have strong connections with people and meaningful relationships. You're one away from the last unhelpful thinking style. Don't forget to comment in the comments below and have a conversation with me about this. I really, really would love to know your experience of your thinking styles. Okay, enjoy the last video. Bye.